hello everyone welcome back to my channel and today we will continue with the addition um, as we are preparing ourselves for grade one we are just revising the addition and the subtraction i want you to practice a lot to master the sums more and more so we're gonna start with the uh, 10 frame to show how it can help us to make our sums more uh, clear and easier so let's begin with this video then let's come back to uh, introduce our concept for today let's watch it together please you can use a 10 frame to show an addition fact with five Would you show five plus three equals? Start with five. How can you show five in the ten frame? Put five counters in the top row, then add three more. Look at the ten frame now. How many counters are in the top row? Select your answer. There are five counters in the top row. How many counters are in the bottom row? There are three counters in the bottom row. How many counters are there in all? There are eight counters in the 10 frame. So five and three more are eight. How does the 10 frame help you see the addition fact five plus three equals eight? It breaks the sum up to show five and three more. How does making five help you use a 10 frame? Making five in the 10 frame makes it easier to see how many more are needed to make 10. It is easier to look for empty frames in one row than in two rows. The 10 frame shows another addition fact. You have eight. Make 10. Two boxes are empty. Add two. When you add two, you make 10. How does the 10 frame help you see the 10 fact? It breaks the number up to show how many more make 10. Eight plus two more is 10. How does the 10 frame show eight plus two equals 10? There are eight red counters and two empty spaces, which is 10 altogether. So eight plus two equals 10. Now you have learned how to show addition facts on a 10 frame. So guys, as you have learned in the video, uh, we have the 10 frame and it's helping us or describing for us the sum that we have. And it's like separating the numbers that we are having in the uh, sum to two parts. Like for example, when I have this equation, when I have this equation like 5 plus 3, what will it equal? I have 5, I will add other 3, like here in step 2, so there in all will be 8. Okay, these are 8. How many empty spaces I have here to reach the 10? I have 1, 2 empty boxes. So, 
it will be another equation we can create another equation um, except the 5 plus 3 we will have one another one it's 8 plus 2 will equal 10 as we explained in the video okay how does a 10 frame help you add 4 5 plus 4 let's see look at the 10 frames write an addition fact with 5 then write an addition fact for 10 so first of all let's see we have 5 plus 4 so we have 5 plus 4 equals 9 okay so I have 5 and 4 they are all together 9 I want to make another equation to add to get the 10 result how many empty boxes I have here yes 1 so in all I have 9 plus 1 equals 10 okay let's go to the second one we want to make an equation using the 5 plus 2 so 5 plus 2 equals 7 okay let's use the 7 to get another equation reaching the 10 after the 7 how many empty boxes we have 1 2 3 so 7 plus 3 equals the 10 great job everyone so in this way the tin the tin frame the tin box frame will help me to make more than one equation and it will make all my work easier okay let's go to the next page mm -hmm. okay also here let's read the instructions look at the 10 frames write an addition fact with 5 then write an addition fact for 10 so in all cases we have here we're gonna start with the 5 let's begin what do you see here we have 5 1 2 3 4 5 plus how much 1 in all they are 6 now I will get the result that I made here which is 6 to build an equation to reach the 10 as a result so how many empty boxes I have here 1 2 3 4 boxes so 10 plus 4 plus 6 equals 10 okay let's go to the second one it's 5 plus 2 equals in all 7 now I will get the 7 to put it here to build a new equation to go to reach the 10 7 plus how many empty boxes I have 3 so 7 plus 3 equals 10 amazing next 5 plus 1 2 3 equals in all 8 now I will take the result which is the 8 I will write it here to build an equation to reach the 10 as a result 8 plus how many empty boxes 2 will equal 10 okay higher order thinking using two colors draw counters in the 10 frames to match the addition equation then write the missing numbers okay so the first equation will be in all I have seven so it will be one two three four five plus two equals seven right how many empty boxes I have 
3. So it will be 7 plus 3 equals 10. Great job! 10 plus which number will give me 10? What do you think? Let's draw 9. First we will draw 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8 and 9. Here I have 9 counters. How many empty spaces I have here? It's 1. So 9 plus 1 equals 10. Great job! So, they asked us to make them two different colors. So let's make the down row with the yellow and the up row keep it blue. Okay, to follow the instructions. So, these were the pages of today, guys. I wish you enjoyed our lesson for today. You can see more pages, um, uh, other two pages. It's optional if you want to do them. You can do them to practice more and to master um, the 10 frames in helping you finding the results. And I wish you enjoyed my lesson for today. Till that time, I will say goodbye. See you tomorrow.